Rick actually has the best chance because he has been the only one that quit smoking. I quit one time for 10 years. I think he quit like for, I don't know, 10 months or something. Shauna's definitely uh, the wild card. I don't know what she'll do. I'm hoping that this time I can do it for good. If she gets serious, I'll put my money on her. No more. I can reconstruct pretty much anything. My concern is the swelling. Um, you know, that may have helped, whatever I just did. John! Good news or bad news? Look what I just did. She looks better than she did a minute ago. Well, I glued her, I glued her mouth, I glued her eye. That looks good. Yeah, I know. It does. Now, if you look at her picture on Chuck's desk, she's got a round, like, heart-shaped face anyway, okay? Any embalmer that's worth of salt will really want to try the challenge of restorative art. See, now I'm, I'm wanting to do this. If the family is happy and grateful that we're doing this, then it's worth it. If the family comes in the room and gets upset or gets angry with us, then it's not worth it because Nobody understands what you have to go through except the embalmer that did the task. We're here today because unexpectedly my mom passed away in an automobile accident. From what we know, apparently, she had some physical problems while she was driving. And whatever it was caused her to um, cross the lanes of traffic and go off the road and run into a boulder. 30 minutes before, someone talked to her. So 30 minutes before she was happy, she'd been planning for a trip. She was going out of town to visit some friends. She was a very happy lady. According to John, you know, the family's great and sweet, and I just regret that, you know, this happened to her because it sure would have been nice to have been able to present her, you know, in a good way. Okay, this is our selection room. Um, any of the wooden containers on this side is suitable for cremation. Or we could go with the cardboard box. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's only $60. Everybody's laughing now, trying not to cry. And we get to see it on Monday, right? Yes. Do you think um, for sure? <laughs> you know, worst case, Monday, but if you don't feel like her face is okay, we can always maybe cover her. I just want to hold her hand and tell her goodbye. Um, okay. Because I yeah. need that, to, that part to be over. So if, um, well, if you don't want me to look at her, then that's OK. Well, no, that's not it. It's just she's not ready yet. She hit so hard that it shattered everything in her body. I just wonder if we bit off more than we can chew here. But I think the makeup is going to make a significant difference, too, because she has a lot of dehydration. And then.